Here in the studio, the Oregon Zoo has brought us one of the largest owls in the world. We have Bree with the Oregon Zoo. Oh my goodness, a milky eagle owl. Who did you bring us today? Yeah, so this is Kamaria and she is a milky eagle owl. These are actually found in Central and Southern Africa. They're the largest owls in Africa and one of the biggest species in the world. Yes, she is huge, but so beautiful. Is it heavy to hold her on your arm? She weighs a whopping five pounds, which doesn't what? sound like much, <laughs> but in this one position for a very long time. She's like, don't body shame me. It could get to be a little <laughs> bit heavy after a while. Right, oh my gosh, just a lot of feathers. Yeah. Very fluffy. Very, very fluffy. And they're kind of like a, a stealthy fighter in the bird world. They bird world. definitely are. They are all about stealth and sneaking up on their prey, not speed. So they're they're going to wait for their prey to zoom by, and with that amazing sight and great hearing at night, they're going to be able to track them down and catch them. And so, of course, the name has eagle in the in there. So, are they are they related to the eagle? Do they just seem like an eagle? They are raptors or birds of prey, just like eagles, which means they use their feet to catch and kill their prey. Uh, but eagle owl really is in reference to their size. Eagle owls are the largest of the owls. So like you say they're a stealth fighter. I'm listening to you tell me this a minute ago and I'm standing like two feet away from her, Is but she seems nice. She is very comfortable <laughs> around people. So Kamaria was hatched at another zoo and she's been around people her entire life. She's been with us and she's about six months old. So she's really used to being around people. I feel like she loves the camera too. She's just like posing. Oh yeah, see, she heard me. She just stared, oh my gosh. It's like she knows that that camera is on her. She might be a little bit of a diva. Oh my gosh, I love it. So if people want to come see Kamaria and other animals, of course they can always go to the Oregon Zoo, but then this weekend there's a Mother's Day brunch happening? There is, yeah. So Sunday, of course, is Mother's Day and we are going to be doing a Mother's Day brunch at the zoo um, from 9 to 1 p.m. where people can come and eat amongst uh, the zoo animals. And then if they'd like afterwards, you can always take admission and go into the zoo. Uh, a great way to see Kamaria is when our summer shows start. So our flight shows starting June 9th will be happening on that She's big about center lawn <laughs> and you can get to see Kamaria fly right over your head. What? That's so cool. Like how close does she come when she's flying over people? Uh, she comes pretty close. She'll fly just a foot or two above people's heads. Sometimes you get grazed by a wing. Wow. Now, does Kamaria ever hang out with any of the other birds, birds of prey, or do they kind of stay off on their own? They tend to like to have their own space, mm -hmm. uh, their own little territories uh, in which to live. Uh, we only have one eagle owl at the zoo, and she's pretty content with that. And will she get to eat anything at this brunch buffet for Mother's Day? She will not be <laughs> attending the brunch buffet for Mother's Day, but I promise she will get her fair share of snacks. I saw she was having a snack just before she's on camera. Is that how you like keep her calm? And Yeah, we use positive reinforcement, which is basically like what you would do with your dog to train them to do different things that you would like them to do. So we want her to make sure she's got calm behavior. When she's showing us that, we give her treats. I thought you were going to say, it's just like we would do with you. Like if your producer wants you to you know, behave for the show, we give you food on the show. It happens. <laughs> yeah, see? She's like, now I just hear you talking about snacks and this is torturing me. So if you want to reserve a spot for the Mother's Day brunch, go to organzoo.org slash mom and then go to the zoo and see the beautiful Kamaria. Thank you so much, Brie. Absolutely. Kamaria, you are amazing. You are not a diva. You are just beautiful. <laughs>